What's up gamers, Joe Ski here, giving you my first look at Battlefield 4's multiplayer. Recorded and brought to you with my Xbox One. Let's jump on in and I'll tell you what I thought about Battlefield's newest installment. And when you think Battlefield, you think massive maps and awesome vehicles. The vehicles in this game let players experience the whole map and also force players to evolve. Here I'm in a light armored boat. I'm getting shot from a tank offshore. There's planes overhead. There's helicopters overhead, forcing players to evolve with the map and adjust their style of gameplay as more vehicles are introduced into the fighting. Now starting in Battlefield Force multiplayer, it's kind of a learn-as-you-go process. Like, learn not to try to shoot at a boat that's offshore while standing in the middle of an area with a rocket launcher out. Because if you try to do that, like I did, you're probably going to get jacked up. Teamwork is key in Battlefield, but be wary when you're spawning in on your team. If you look here in the lower left-hand corner, it'll show what your teammate sees before you spawn on him. And if it says warning, chances are you're going to be killed soon after you spawn. As always, Battlefield's maps are beautiful and stunning. They also transform as gameplay continues. This was a beautiful island map, still is, but it was a beautiful sunny day, perfect day at the beach. Suddenly a storm came raging in, visibility cut in half, waves being tossed in the air, boats being tossed in the air. Just transformed the whole map. As always, Battlefield gives you a beautiful, piece of art to do battle on. The lighting, the shading is all beautiful on this map. Excellent job. Now, Battlefield is not a toe-to-toe -to -toe first person shooter. Tactics such as flanking and getting behind your opponent are key. If you try to engage all of your opponents head on, chances are something like this is going to happen to you. One of the newest additions to Battlefield for the consoles is the Commander Mode allowing you to, at level 10, assume the commander role, order all your squads around, and as long as they listen, it works out pretty well. You can assist them with UAVs while battling the opponent, opposing commander with counter UAVs, EMP UAVs, and proxy attacks, allowing for, if it works and everyone works as a team, awesome teamwork and great gameplay. That's all from me, guys. Remember to like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, tell me what you thought about it. We'll see you next time, and as always, good game.